Hey, what's up? It's Justin from Chinese Drama Land, and welcome back to another video on the channel. In today's video, I'm going to list the top 10 most anticipated upcoming Chinese historical dramas set to premiere this summer, 2023, on Tencent, Aichi, Yoku, and Mango TV. You must add to your watch list. Most of the dramas on this list are S plus dramas, which means they have a high production value, so expect to see amazing visuals from most of these dramas. I'm not going to include modern dramas on this list, but towards the end of the video, I'm going to give notable mentions to some upcoming Chinese modern dramas slated to premiere this summer you should add to your watch list as well, so make sure to watch this video till the end. Let me know in the comment section down below which of these dramas you're looking forward to this summer. Just a quick reminder, the dramas on this list appear in no particular order, so it's not a ranked list. If you go on to enjoy the video, make sure to hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon if you want to get notified when I upload new videos like this in the future. With that being said, let's get started with the video. Number 1. Love You 7 Times Love You 7 Times is a 36 episode costume Shan Xiao romance drama starring Ryan Ding and Yang Chao Yu. Yang Chao Yu plays Xiang Yun, a girl who was originally a cloud turned into a fairy by Yu Lao, the god of marriage and love in Chinese mythology. Ryan Ding plays Chu Kong, a boy who accidentally broke into Yu Lao's pavilion. Whilst quarreling with Xiang Yun one time, they unintentionally messed up Yu Lao's red thread thus wreaking havoc in the Three Realms, and this begins their cycle through seven lifetimes to fulfill the Jade Emperor's punishment before they can return to the heavenly realm. Number 2. Wonderland of Love Wonderland of Love is a 46-episode historical political romance drama starring Xu Kai and Jing Tian. The drama is based on a newly published novel by the same author, who brought us Goodbye My Princess, and she also serves as the drama's executive scriptwriter. Anyway, Xu Kai plays Li Yi, the noble grandson of the emperor who didn't get his father's love while growing up. He hides his real identity as a prince because he has no intention of fighting for power. He just wants to be a carefree general guarding the border. Li Yi gets tasked with the responsibility of quelling the rebellion and he meets Cui Lin, played by Jing Tian, the only daughter of the Cui family who disguises herself as a general to join the army. The two butt heads on everything but later fall in love. Wonderland of Love was directed by Steve Chung who also directed the 2019 hit BL drama The Untamed and The Legends that starred Shu Kai. So this is Shu Kai and director Steve Chung's second time working together. Feiwo Sutsun, the drama's author and scriptwriter, enjoys writing angsty and toxic romances full of heartbreak like she did with the 2019 drama Goodbye My Princess. Number 3. The Legend of Shun Li the Legend of Shen Li is a 40-episode costume Xian Chao romance drama starring Zhao Liying and Kenny Lin, based on the novel accompanying the Phoenix. Zhao Liying plays Shen Li, an experienced general bestowed with the title of Princess Bi Song, who was born in the demon realm. Pressured into a political marriage with the Emperor's celestial son on her 1000th birthday, she transforms into her original form, a Phoenix, after she gets injured in a fight. Kenny Lin plays Hong Ji, the last remaining god amongst the ancients in the world who chose to distance himself from everyone, but fate intervenes when the two meet in the human world in the unlikeliest of situations. This is Zhao Liying and Kenny Lin's second reunion. They both starred in the 2017 hit historical drama Princess Agents. And I know this is not the Princess Agents reunion we've been waiting for, but hey, at least we'll get to see Zhao Liying and Kenny Lin on screen again. Number 4. The Legend of An Le The Legend of An Le is a 39-episode historical romance drama starring Dil Raba and Simon Gong. Legend of An Le is adapted from the novel of the same name by author Xing Ling. Dil Raba plays Di Zuyuan, a girl who seeks revenge after her entire family was falsely accused of treason and beheaded under the Emperor's order 10 years ago before the story starts. As the only survivor, she changes her name to Ren An Le, and schemes her way into the palace. Simon Gong plays Han Ye, the crown prince. He's kind and cares for the common people's welfare. 
Anne Le soon finds herself falling for Han Ye, but at the same time, she's unable to put behind the hatred between their families. Driven by his deep love for Anne Le, Han Ye vows to resolve their differences at any cost, while at the same time deciding how to achieve justice for her family's death. Eventually, they join hands and go to the battlefield as they defend their kingdom against foreign forces. Dil Raba's character in this drama is similar to her character in The Long Ballad, and the drama was directed by one of the directors who directed Word of Honor. Number 5. Lost You Forever Lost You Forever is a 72-episode costume fantasy romance drama starring Yang Zi, Zhang Wanyi, Deng Wei, and Tan Jian Si. Lost You Forever is based on a novel series, and it tells the love story of love and grief between a young maiden, her cousin, a noble, and a general. Yang Zi plays a girl who runs away from home and gets kidnapped and tortured by a nine-tailed fox. She manages to escape and settles down in a village as a doctor, and she meets Deng Wei's character, who was injured but she cures him, and their love blossoms. She later meets Tan Jian Si's character, a general who always blackmailed her to give him medicine, or else he'll take her life. She later gets found by her cousin, played by Zhang Wan Yi, who takes her back home. Lost You Forever has a stellar cast, and I can't wait for it to premiere. Zhang Wan Yi's last historical drama to air is the 2021 drama Weaving a Tale of Love, where he played a supporting role, and this drama is his first costume fantasy drama. Tan Jian Si's last historical drama to air is the 2021 drama Court Lady, where he played the second male lead, and this is also his first costume fantasy drama, and I am also looking forward to his upcoming historical BL drama, Winner is King, co-starring Chun Jo Yan. Before I continue with the video, I want to thank you guys for your support on Ko-Fi. If you'd like to support me, consider giving this video a super thanks. It's the heart-shaped button with the dollar sign below this video. Or you can support me on my Ko-Fi by contributing a dollar or more, and I'll leave the link to my Ko-Fi page in the description down below. Number 6. Mysterious Lotus Casebook Mysterious Lotus Casebook is a 40-episode historical mystery suspense wuxia drama starring Joseph Zheng, Cheng Yi, and Xiao Shunyao, adapted from a novel of the same name. Cheng Yi plays Liu Xiang Yi, the sect master of Sigu Gate. Ten years ago, he shook the martial arts world, but after a decisive battle with the leader of the Golden Mandarin League, the two masters disappeared from the martial arts world, and people thought he died. Li Xiang Yi later changes his name to Li Lianhua, and people mistook him for a great doctor who can bring the dead back to life. Joseph Zeng plays Fang Duobing, an aspiring hero who idolizes Li Xiang Yi. He's also a close friend of Li Lianhua, but has no idea who he is. Xiao Shunyao plays Di Fei Sheng, Li Xiang Yi's arch rival, who's suspicious of his real identity, and vows to expose him. Whenever there's a murder case, people ask Li Xiang Yi for help, and together with his friends, Fang Duobing and Di Fei Sheng, they solve many mysterious cases in the martial arts world, and the three forge a deep friendship. I haven't read the drama's novel, but I hope we get a bromance between the male leads. Number 7. The Longest Promise The Longest Promise is a 43-episode costume Xian Xiao romance drama starring Xiao Zhan and Ren Min, and it's adapted from the novel Zhu Yan, and it's a prequel to last year's costume fantasy romance drama Mirror Twin Cities, starring Li Feng and Yuki Chen. The Longest Promise released its first trailer during the 2021 Tencent Video Annual Press Conference, and it looks emotional and tearful, at least to me. Anyway, the drama takes place in Kongsan Continent and revolves around the tumultuous love story between Shi Ying and Zhu Yan. Xiao Zhan plays Shi Ying, a prince of Kongsan Continent who gets banished to the mountain to cultivate after his mother was framed. Originally focused on nothing but cultivation, he begins to develop romantic feelings for Zhu Yan, his disciple played by Ren Min, the princess of the Qi Yi tribe. Shi Ying and Zhu Yan don't voice out their feelings due to their teacher-student relationship. Their love is forbidden, as they find themselves standing on opposite sides in the fight for political struggle and undergo life and death situations together. They eventually put aside their issues and work together hand in hand 
to protect Kongsan Continent. Number 8. Snow Eagle Lord Snow Eagle Lord is a 40-episode costume fantasy romance drama starring Shu Kai and Gulina Jia. Snow Eagle Lord is based on a novel that has been adapted into a popular anime series. Anyway, the drama is set in a mythical world in the mainland continent, and it tells the story of a boy raised in a small peaceful town, played by Shu Kai, whose peaceful life is disturbed when his parents get arrested by a foreign tribe. So he's left with the responsibility of protecting his brother and rescuing his family. Gulina Jia plays Yu Jing Chu, his love interest. Number 9. The Demon Hunter's Romance The Demon Hunter's Romance is a 36-episode costume fantasy romance drama starring Alan Ren and Song Zhu Ar that tells the story of a forbidden romance between a black leopard demon of the fairy soul, played by Alan Ren, and a human with a demonic heart, played by Song Zhu Ar. There's a 9-year age gap between Alan Ren and Song Zhu Ar, and I can't wait to see how that plays out in the drama. Anyway, Song Zuar's last costume drama to air is the 2020 costume fantasy drama Guardians of the Ancient Oath, co-starring Liu Wu and Xuan Yan. Xuan Yan also plays a supporting role in this drama, so this is Song Zuar and Xuan Yan's second reunion. Number 10. Destined Destined is a 40-episode historical romance drama starring Bai Jingting and Song Yi. Let me give a quick honorable mention to some upcoming Chinese modern dramas slated to premiere this summer you should add to your watch list as well. My Fireworks on Earth, starring Yang Yang and Wang Churan. My Fireworks on Earth is a 40-episode drama adapted from the web novel Waiting for You in a City by Zhou Yoshi and tells the story of a firefighter and an emergency medic played by Yang Yang and Wang Churan respectively who were separated by their family when they were younger. Ten years later, they meet again due to their professions. After experiencing a life-and-death situation together, they rekindle their old feelings. My Fireworks on Earth also stars Vin Zhang and Yang Chao Yu as they make guest appearances, and its first trailer, which was released last year, is action-packed and showcases plenty of fires and life-threatening situations. Rising with the Wind, starring Gong Jun and Elaine Zhong, Rising with the Wind is a 40-episode drama that tells the story of Elaine Zhong's character, Jiang Hu, a smart, powerful, but self-willed and arrogant girl who has been living under the love of her father, Jiang Qisheng, the chairman of a clothing company. One day, she loses her father and his enterprise starts falling apart. Returning to the ordinary world, she decided to spare no effort in keeping her father's first casual shoe brand, Tang Yu, so she decides to meet Xu Si, played by Gong Jun, an investor who wants to purchase Tang Yu and sell it at a low price. Zhang Hu and Xu Si later decide to run the company by themselves, so Zhang Hu recruits Xiang Jiaoyang, played by Wu Xianyi, a designer, and Yang Jian, played by Gao Zhiting, an online store operator, to form an entrepreneurial team to help revive her father's company. Through the internet and business methods, they open up new sales channels for the old brand, and they received government-guided funds. South Wind Knows My Mood, starring Cheng Yi and Zhang Yuxi. South Wind Knows My Mood is a 40-episode drama that tells the story of Fu Yunshan and Zhu Jiu, who go on a humanitarian tour together to serve underdeveloped areas. Cheng Yi plays a skilled botanist who uses his expertise with plants to develop life-saving medicine. Zhang Yuxi plays a surgeon who works for MSF, it's worth mentioning, this is the third time Chang Yi and Zhang Yuxi are working together. They both starred in 2021's historical romance drama Stand By Me, and 2020's hit Xian Xia romance drama Love and Redemption. Bright Eyes in the Dark, starring Johnny Huang and Zhang Jingyi. Bright Eyes in the Dark is a 40-episode drama that tells the story of Zhang Jingyi's character, Nan Chu. When she was 16 years old, she was trapped in a house fire, and in her semi-conscious and dazed state, she saw the blurred form of a firefighter, Lin Lu Xiao, played by Johnny Huang, who rescued her. Five years later, Nan Chu, now 21, has become a popular model and actress. By chance, the two meet again when he is picked as an instructor on a reality TV show she is hosting. 
aimed at popularizing knowledge about firefighting. There's an attraction between the two, but there's also a reluctance to give in to it given the danger of his job. But after the other party fell in love with her, she turned around and left again, after which she was asked for peace again. Hidden Love, starring Chen Zhiyan and Zhao Lusi. Hidden Love is a 25 episode drama based on a popular web novel, and it tells the story of Song Zhi and Duan Jia Xu, played by Zhao Lusi and Chen Zhiyan, respectively. Zhao Lusi plays a girl who falls in love with a boy who often comes to her house to play games in her older brother's room, played by Chen Zhiyan. A boy who is seven years older than her, she had a crush on him when she was young, but they lost contact with each other. After she graduates, she joins the university in the city he's in, and during their day-to-day -day intimate and close interaction, they slowly fall in love. This drama is Zhao Lusi's first high school modern romance drama, and I'm looking forward to it. As for Chen Zhiyun, he starred in 2021's hit high school modern romance drama, Our Secret, with Rainbow Shu. If you'd like to support me, consider giving this video a super thanks. It's the heart-shaped icon with the dollar sign below this video. Or you can support me on my Ko-Fi by contributing a dollar or more, and I'll leave the link to my Ko-Fi page in the description down below. Let me know in the comment section down below which of these dramas you're looking forward to this summer. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to hit the like button, and don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon if you want to get notified when I upload new videos like this in the future. If you want to watch more videos like this, click on one of the videos on the screen right now. That's all I have for you today. Stay safe, stay well, and I'll see you in the next video.